Hawaii. Tip number two I'd like to share with you is never teach the fish how to swim. Never teach the fish how to swim. Many years ago, in a Toastmaster setting, I was invited as an outsider to share some tips on public speaking. And I was also there to launch my book, Speak with Impact. And there were about 200 people in the crowd and I was given 10 minutes. 10 minutes later, I went back to my booth and I was expecting maybe I could sell some 50 books. But to my uh, shock, I was only able to sell three copies. Then I was actually curious. So I asked one of the uh, senior uh, um, Toastmaster member and she was very, uh, very honest with me. And she said, Jackson, uh, what you shared just now, we already know. Yeah, we are all experienced speakers and you share this with us. So I was, I was like uh, speechless and I was like thinking, what do they really know? But because very few people bought my book, I realized that maybe I did not go into the content that they are looking for. So very importantly, ladies and gentlemen, do not teach the fish how to swim because the fish already know how to swim. Well, if I knew my audience better at that time, I would have crafted and delivered different content. Why I didn't know them? Because I did not have enough research. I did not do enough homework about the audience. And that was the reason why there is no connection between me and the audience. Why? Because I did not quite understand the audience and their needs. So very importantly, if you want to be engaging, you need to spend time to know what do the audience really looking for? What are they uh, really want to learn? What do they really want to listen? And this is where you go in strong and solid by preparing your content to match their learning needs. Thank you for watching this video. I see you in the next video.